All right, hello there, viewers. This is your host, MC Redsmith. I know I haven't done my usual intro, but I'm currently, I don't know. Yeah, there we go. I'm currently uh, trying to do some hunting right fast. I kind of split off from Wolf, as uh, you may have noticed in his uh, video. Uh, out trying to do some hunting, trying to gather up some game. Oh, there's a wreckage up there. Okay. Yeah. I'll, uh, I'm just out hunting right now, seeing if I can find some deer. I'm out here near, uh, the, uh, peninsula, whatever that is. Uh, let's see. Is there a deer here? Hmm. I don't want to make too much noise because I know that they can, like, sent you a good distance off so or at least that's what I found so far anytime I've tried to do a little bit of hunting and of course me being you know rifle oriented I can generally snipe something from a pretty good distance so let's see is that a deer that looks like flowers okay Okay, I see a car down there that doesn't look damaged, like it's been in a wreck or anything. Uh, let's see. I'm not seeing any deer so far. Let's see. Are there any zombies nearby? Uh, best to go prone, just in case. I'm going to sneak up on these wrecked vehicles here. Prone, just to make sure... Because I'm not seeing any in my scope. Managed to find a 7x uh, seven uh, seven times zoom scope, by the way, and a uh, suppressor when uh, I went to the military base. Alright. I'm almost to the uh, wrecked vehicles now, as you can see, viewers. I just got a couple more ridges. Actually, tell you what, I'm just going to get down on the road and uh see if there's anything there tell you what i'll just crouch and sneak up that way all right so far i'm not seeing anything what is that looks like a blood bag i could we could definitely use that Time to go prone here in just a second. Yeah, I'm seeing blood bag, baton. Looks like a uh, Mountie suit. I'm going to see if I can make it to that blood bag real quick. Grab that. There's a knapsack. Anyways, I hope you all are enjoying uh, the videos. Uh, sorry it's been a while since I've uploaded some. Uh, I know I had a few that uh, were scheduled for release of Unturned with uh, Nathan and, uh, you know, me and everything. Okay, I don't know. Okay, that's up on the hood of that truck. All right. Let's see. Do I got... I have no space for that. Okay, so I got to get out of friggin' prone here. Can I access my inventory? Yes, I can. All right. What do I want to drop? Nathan could use the seeds. I really need the nails for arrows. I got a bonjour clip that's only got two rounds in it, but I know I need that just in case I run out of munition on my uh, maple strike. And there goes my mouse not wanting to work. Yeah, I even found a katana. Don't tell Wolf. Uh, tell you what, I'm just going to drop the cloth and... Uh, get the blood bag I'm not seeing any deer though maybe there might be some a little bit closer up so far it seems to be okay there might be some out here I mean I do see some buildings up there Any 
anyways, like I was saying, you know, I'm hoping that y'all are enjoying it because I'm going to be doing a lot more of these. Uh, especially, you know, since me and Wolf have been doing that. And I ain't believing that, you know, he in his last video that he posted that, you know, he thinks that he tricked me or, you know, kind of forced me into doing an outing with his son. I mean, come on, I was protecting his son from freaking getting killed. You know, you don't send a boy out on a recon mission, let alone a friggin mission to gather up supplies in a zombie apocalypse. I mean, you do that, you're asking to get you killed. killed. You know, it angers me a little bit. And I say a little bit, I mean, If anything at all, I think he should have done the outing with his son, but I guess he just needed to talk some things over with uh, our matrix so that, uh, you know, okay, this is like a golf course. I'm seeing a hole here. Okay, I see an ambulance down there. It looks like it's burning. All right. There's a note up here it looks like I even read in the latest patch that there was a note here or with the notes how oh, it's been placed nothing written on it all right uh, I guess I'll write something on it since I'm here and you know I just hope a zombie doesn't creep up behind me or something uh, it'd help if I could type way to fern wood farm and let us know if you need help Scouting party leader MC Red Smith. All right, I've written on that now. So far, I do not see any zombies, but I'm going to go ahead and check out the building up here. Might be some. Looks like somebody's up there. All right, he might be in trouble. I better get my butt up there. Let's see. So far, it doesn't look like any zombies are around here, but that doesn't mean they're not pinned. Don't have him pinned up down there. Is it, did he just shoot at Who me? Who the hell are you? Dude, I'm, I just came out here to freaking see if you're alright, man. I'm part of a group from at Fernwood Farm, man. Just out doing a scouting Four mission. People? Yeah. Part of a group. You know, we're willing to help other people as we find them, other survivors. Are you in need of help, man? A little bit. I mean, you see my car down there is all fucked up and shit. Yeah, I can see that, dude. I'm looking at it through my scope right now. 
Uh, is, uh, is it okay if I come a little bit closer? Do you need any food or anything? I'm em empty handed and you may approach. Alright, I'm putting away my my weapon. Alrighty. Alright. Anybody else up there with you? Nope, just me and my lonesome self. Okay, uh... Well, I'm MC Redsmith from, you know... Group up there at Fernwood Farms. I'm the scouting party. See oh, so that's your place I saw whether or not. Oh, you were out that way? Okay, well, you could Thanks could've... for the shotgun, by the way. Uh, no problem. Uh, you know, if you needed it, you know, heck, we really didn't need it at that point. You know, I mean, we've, we've got a lot of ammunition. All right. Dude, your vehicle is like really on fire. <laughs> I doubt it can be salvaged. It's like red, so. Kids, that comes to show you don't drink and drive. Well, yeah. Um, I see you got a uh, snare sitting out here. Yeah, be careful with that. Yeah, and uh, a wood shield is that your makeshift door or something? Yeah. It works. All that matters. Yep. Uh, I'm seeing a uh, gun out back of your house here, just so you know. Uh, is that okay if I come oh, up? Shit. I'm coming down. Oh, okay. Oh, there you are. Hello. Hello. Um, the naked. Magic, magic outfit you got there. Yeah. Um, I see your name is the Naked Cowboy, and. Well, you are naked, and you are wearing a cowboy hat, and you do have a shotgun. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, the gun that I saw was back here, uh, if you want to grab it. It's right here. It's a uh, Magnum. Yeah, I'll, I'll get back away so that, you know, you can grab it if you want. I'm not drawing out a weapon, just to show friendly intent. you have any room? Uh, no, but I did pick up a uh, blood bag uh, up the road there where there was an accident. Do you need it? I heard a uh, crunch. Yeah, you pick up the gun. I'll take the the blood bag. Hey, to help me. Yeah. There you go. Oh, uh, sorry, I kind of equipped that. Let me drop it there. There you go. Uh, I'll pick it up for you, and uh, then we'll just I'll just uh, drop it off up in your base there. Pretty defensible position there. Have He's to, all good. I have to admit, I mean, I didn't even notice you up there till I get up about, I want to say, midway past that first pole there, towards the second. So, you know, that is a good position. Well, as you can tell, it's kind of cold out here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> kind of tell down, yeah. Do you have any clothes or anything at your space? Uh, well... We can, I can make a uh, supply run for you, but uh, as far as coming back to the group itself, I'd have to talk that over with Wolf and Out, and uh, see if uh, we can, see if I can let him, well, basically what I'm saying is talk him into letting you into the group so that, you know, you can, you know, have protection, dude, because if you're the only one out here, you know, I don't want to see you, like, this? waste away. Um... I hold you hostage, can message your friend, and if he wants you back, he will let me in the group. How does that sound? Mm, well, there, there's a few things here that uh, you might not realize about me. As you I made, have a shotgun point a point blank at your head. One shot, your head's coming off. Yeah, I do agree there. There is a bit of that, but, you know, then you would have no negotiation tool, and I'm pretty sure my group would come after you pretty hardcore. If I didn't but come I'd back. I have all your shit, though. Yeah, you might have all my stuff, but they're a lot better marksmen than me. And there's a lot more of them. And I don't have that many but rounds. I have the height advantage. 
they'd be and able I'm to only one person they could take you out trust me are you sure okay while you're up there on the balcony trying to take pot shots at one guy that's far off out there in the distance three or four of them would be climbing up that ladder after you you can only take them out one at a time or you had a nice gun I heard was hunting a minute ago yeah when you climb up a ladder I noticed the physics that you don't come up with a loaded hand end. right I stand up there with a shotgun boom boom everybody's dead and who has the upper hand there right but then you lose track of the guy out in the field that's a marksman maxed out marksman skill Got a if better you gun to me. The ladder right quick, please. All right, I'm on. Uh, how are they gonna get me when I am, you know, up here next to the ladder? How are they gonna be able to see me? Well, like when I'm I said, this building here, in this corner right over here, popping off your guys' heads when they show their heads right there. How are they gonna hit me from the outside down below? Well, there is a tactical error there because if you want to move over to that corner I could show you even though that you're popping their heads off there guy notices that he's down there at the bottom he could take you out because the shotgun won't reach down there it can but, but it, it'll spread a rifle, though, and if you're right dead, but it's slow your rifle yeah but it's a slow pull does it matter uh, yes, it does. They'll be when scattering it... out, and I'll be popping them off when they're running through the uh, little area there. And they've also got grenades, too, so. One good toss, and you're gone, dude. That's all I can say. They're well, like a three second. I can run in this little room right here, let the blast take care of it. Actually, by the time the grenade, by the time the grenade would reach this height, it would already explode by the time it got up in here. Well, like I said, you got pretty good armor on, so... Well, actually, the armor that I got on is not the best. It's only a police uh, armor and, you know... Quit negotiating. You are my hostage now. Contact your friends, I'm, and you can go. I am trying to be nice here, dude. I, I don't want... I don't want to pull it, okay? I could give you don't something... I can give you something that will help you. Like I said, I picked up this magnum for you. I am going to drop it off. Okay? There. There's your magnum. Now, you know, you see how I'm crouched, right? Alright. F negotiating. <laughs> I think he turned off PvP. <laughs> I think you did too. <laughs> taking damage. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, uh, cluster fucking our part. I hope you enjoyed the episode. <laughs> we will see you back here in a bit. But seriously, man, if you want to come and be a part of the group, man, this this actually helped me blow off some steam, man. I I appreciate it, dude. Really, quit. I, I like that, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh man, you're gonna be a great addition to the group, man. But yeah. Tune in next time where we don't function so much. <laughs> yeah. Later. <laughs>